Yeah, I mean, we talk through disruptive technologies, and, and the big themes that we put out there, and I think were echoed in some of the questions, were around consumerization and adoption of, of technology and technology innovation. Uh, it was around the security and the hurdles, uh, what's preventing kind of adoption in organizations, and then really around the ROI models and, and, and timing, and, and when should I be adopting these technologies, and are the ROIs harder or softer, or you know, how do, how do I really ingrain these technologies, if you will, into my business, and how do I cut through, if you will, a lot of the hype that's around them and really cut down to what makes sense in my organization relative to those opportunities and those hurdles. Yeah, the biggest concern, you know, I, I think security right now it would have to be the biggest concern. And, and that's due to, if you look at all of the disruptive technologies today, right, social, mobile, uh, analytics, and cloud, the smack you call them, every one of them has a thread of exposing more information, of bringing more people into the fold. Whether it's additional consumer channels that I'm using to access consumers, or even additional tools that I'm providing to my, my internal employees. It's all about more collaboration, more data. The dark underbelly, if you will, around more collaboration and more data is things have to be more open, right? To share, I have to be open. And a mentality that we've had in technology over the years of sort of surround and protect Right, lock down the data center, is almost in, 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 in the, the antithesis of this concept of being able to share and collaborate. So you've got sort of almost a direct butting of heads, if you will, where I see the value in this collaboration, I see the value in deploying these technologies, but it's a whole different mindset. It's no longer surround and protect. You've got to be more strategic. What I look for in 2015 is the coming together of these disruptive technologies. Right? How can I apply you know, analytics in the back end to really take the data that I have and the new data sources that are available to me and grind out you know, competitive decision making. How can I take mobile, for example, and put a face on that, that analytics that my users can interact with that can actually act upon and create decision making around it? How can I harness social and then collaborate those ideas? And then lastly, can I do it on the cloud to cut down costs and to open my model? So, the, the trick, if you will, in these disruptive technologies for the coming year or years is to how I can weave them together, get past the, the singular focused what I call shiny object syndrome of, of putting in technology X for outcome Y and understanding how they all fit together and drive business goals, be that simple ROI, be that business transformation uh, on either end of the spectrum. I can use these technologies in, in their places and integrate it together and start to drive real competitive value.